Okay, in this video we're going to start looking at converting between polar and rectangular equations. And again, these are kind of the, uh, the equations that relate our polar coordinates to our rectangular coordinates. So we're going to find the rectangular form of each of these given polar equations. So kind of the idea is, so okay, so here we've got r equals 3 times cosine of theta. Well, to me, um, we could always, on the left side, we could even solve for r on the left. Uh, we could have that r equals the square root of x squared plus y squared. But the problem is, if I plug that on the left, I still don't know what to plug in on the right. So, if only there was an extra r hanging out on the right, we would have r cosine theta, and then I could uh, replace that with an x. Well, that's what I'm going to do. I'll just multiply both sides by r. So by r, and then we'll multiply the right side by r. So we have uh, r squared equals, I'm going to write it as 3r cosine theta. But now we can just start using our formula. So r squared is the same thing as x squared plus y squared. r cosine theta, that's the same thing as x. So if you wanted to, we could write this as x squared minus 3x plus y squared equals 0. And hey, uh, now we've turned it into uh, an equation involving rectangular coordinates or Cartesian coordinates. So that's all there is to it. Um, I would just say, so the solution here would just be x squared minus 3x plus y squared equals 0.